Yes, yes, yes. What's going on, guys? Day Trading Attic here. And today we are going to talk about a simple candlestick pattern that will help you take high quality trades. Okay. And also at the end of the video, I'm going to show you a live trade and just show you an example of what I'm talking about. So let's go. Now, I'm going to try to make this video quick. And the whole idea of this video is to help you with your discipline and patience, right? So I want you guys to learn how to wait and look for high quality trades. Now, when it comes to candlesticks, a lot of you guys, when you see your favorite candlestick setup, you want to get in right away. Now, sometimes it's not bad to get in right away if you see a good candlestick setup, but sometimes it's good to wait and be the second mouse, okay? A lot of you guys want to just hop in right away and you want to be that first mouse. And a lot of times the first mouse gets trapped. So I want you guys to just learn how to wait and wait for a high quality setup. So today we're going to talk about a very simple candlestick pattern, nothing fancy, all right? We're going to talk about a double top and a lower high or a lower low, okay? So let me show you guys some quick examples. So right here, guys, we have, okay, resistance right here. It was support, but it turned into resistance. So now notice how, let me zoom in real quick for you guys. Notice how this candle is touching resistance, right? Some of you guys want to get in right away. Again, there's nothing wrong with that. You can still make money if you want to get in right away. If you want to be that first mouse, there's nothing wrong with that. But sometimes it's good to just practice just waiting and waiting for another retest. So right here we have the market going down and it pops back up. Notice how we have this nice double top right here. Have this nice bearish bar right here. To me, this is a good, lovely trade because now we have nice double top. It's giving you more confirmation. So if you just go with that first touch, okay, with that one candlestick, yes, a lot of times you can make money with it, but sometimes, you know, you might get trapped. So that double test, right, gives you more confirmation. And a lot of times those are very high quality setups. So let me show you guys another example. So right here, guys, we have the market breaking down, selling off a lot right here. And also it created this nice supply zone right here, right? So we have this nice supply zone right here and the market came back to it. Now, you can always get in as soon as it hits that supply zone. You can do that. But let's say that you're not too sure and you just want to wait for that extra confirmation. There's nothing wrong with that because sometimes, you know, waiting for that extra confirmation is what's going to help you have more winners. So right here we have a touch, okay, and then it comes back and then we have this double top right at supply. So to me, this nice rejection right here, okay, it looks good for that sell to the downside. So this is what I'm talking about, waiting for that high quality setup, right? Now, this is supply and demand. If you don't know what supply and demand is, I have a whole bunch of videos about that and also I have an indicator that will help beginners. I don't talk about it a lot, but let me show you guys real quick. Okay, so here's the supply and demand indicator. Again, this is for beginners. You don't really need it. Once you understand how to read price action yourself, you know, you can do this by yourself, okay? But if you want to get your feet wet, here is an indicator for you. So right here we have aggressive selling, which is supply, okay? Notice how it came back. So we have this yellow candle right here, and you have the S that stands for supply. Now, notice how right here, let me move this real quick. Notice right here, guys, we have aggressive selling right here, okay? Another aggressive selling right here to the downside, and pretty much right here, aggressive selling, Okay, so this will help you look for key levels if you don't understand supply and demand. And also it comes with buy and sell confirmation. So let me show you that real quick. So right here, guys, these sell and confirmations, it just gives you confidence. It's not telling you to say, hey, go short right here. It's giving you confidence and confirmation and then letting you know, you know what? It's a possibility that the market might go down right here. So this might be a good time to go short. So this is only good at key levels. So notice how we have short, but the market's going up. So you don't want to go short, okay? But when the market starts to break down and we are at key levels, notice how we have a short right here, short right here, comes back down, short right here, short right here. So again, it's for beginners. You don't need it if you know how to read price action. And I forget to tell people where to get this. The only way to get this if you have my trading program. So if you don't have my trading program, the link is in the description. I actually have a sale going on. So make sure you check that out. And guys and girls, please watch out for these scammers that's trying to type in the comment section whatsapp numbers or telling you to send you crypto guys i don't do anything on whatsapp i'm not going to contact you first i'm not going to tell you send me crypto right so let's go to the next example 
Okay, so here's the next example, guys. Remember, if the market's going up, we're looking for either a double bottom or a high and low. So right here, we have a support level right here. The market bounced off that support level. It came back right to this nice demand area, okay? And basically, it bounced off and it came right back, okay? So we made a high and low right here. So let me show you guys real quick so you guys can see. Just high and low right here. So this low is higher than this low. So notice how we have this nice bullish bar right here. That's a good place to go long, okay? And basically, we're looking for our profits. So to me, in my opinion, this is a very high quality trade because you're waiting for more confirmation. Again, you can just say, you know what? Man, I want to get in the first time You know, I see a candlestick that I want. You can do that, okay? But a lot of times, it's good to wait for that extra confirmation now if you want even more extra confirmation okay what you can do is instead of getting in right here as soon as it goes above that candlestick you can say you know what i want to wait till it breaks the high so this is even more confirmation right here so we have that double test right here this high or low and then you want it to break this high right here for more confirmation because if it breaks that high that means we're making higher highs and that means that most likely we will continue to go back up, All right? So let me show you guys another example. Okay, so right here we have the market breaking down, okay? And it comes back to the supply zone. Now, you can be that first guy that say, you know what? As soon as I see a nice candlestick, I'm in. And notice how it worked right here, okay? Or you can say, you know what? Let me just wait for a little bit more confirmation. And you get it right here, guys. The market went up. It went down, right? It created another supply right here and then it came back to that all right i like this nice engulf ball right here could have went short right there right and then you can look for profits so this will help you guys just be patient wait for a, a good setup and take it so let me show you guys another example and then we're going to go to the live trade okay guys so here's another example all right so pretty much the market was trending down now it looks like it wants to go back up it's finding some type of support right here and it goes back up right but notice how it didn't create a new high so you're saying to yourself man i'm not too sure what the market wants to do and notice how it cracks back down with a lot of selling and now you're nervous and saying you know what i don't know i don't think this is a market that i want to really go long so i'm just going to wait okay and again waiting is good so we have the market going down and to me i like this right here because we have a nice supply zone. So you, you can either go with that last candle and this glass candle is kind of small. So if you want to basically use this red candle right here, you can use that. So it came back to supply right here, right? And basically we had a nice sell off. Now notice how we created another supply right here. Okay. And the market came back, made a double top at this supply zone. So to me, if I'm not too sure about the market and I'm waiting and now I see a double top and a nice rejection off of that nice supply zone, guess what? That's a nice high quality trade. So right here, guys, is a good example of just waiting, right? If you're not sure of the market, it's not clear to you, just wait. A lot of times the market will speak to you and it's going to tell you what it really wants to do. So right here, we're just waiting, waiting, then boom, we see this nice double top right at the supply nice rejection you know what i want to go short right here and look for my profits okay so let me go to the live trade right now okay so this is where i pretty much started to record my screen you're noticing i'm actually putting this rectangle box that's my support level actually let me go to trading view so you guys can see much better okay so here's trading view okay to show you guys what i was talking about so right here we have a nice support level and the market is pretty much bullish trend. Short term, it could be a short term trend, whatever the case is, it's in a nice bullish trend right here. And we have nice support right here. So when the market hit that um, support, to me, um, I was looking for some type of reaction. Now let's go back to the five minute chart. All right, so we are at the five minute chart, okay? And notice how the market went back to that support area and we made a nice double bottom. So when I saw this uh, double bottom and this nice bullish bar, I went long, okay? The market went up, it pulled back a little bit, and then it started to go up again. When it started to go up again, I added some more 
and then the market went up. So this is where we are at right now. So I'm looking to get out either right here or right here if the market looks like it's going to stall out. So I'm going to fast forward to show you guys what happened next. So right here, guys, the market is pushing up and I'm looking to see if it's going to react to this high right here. And it's pulling right now. If you notice, it's going to pull back a little bit. And as soon as it pulled back a little bit, I just got out. OK, I just got out right there. And basically, um, if you look to the left, I'm up two thousand seven hundred and eight dollars and fifty cents. OK, so that was a good trade. And if you guys are wondering what market this is, it's the Nasdaq 100. OK, and it's the five minute chart. So guys and girls, that's all I have for you guys. I wanted to show you a live example of what I'm talking about. Just waiting for a little bit more confirmation before you get in. So I believe that strategy will help you with your trading. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and make sure you join my free telegram group where I post motivational videos and exclusive discounts for my trading program. And if you don't have my trading program by now, make sure you pick that up because it could take your trading to the next level. I actually have a sale going on. So make sure you go in the description below to check that out. And if you have any questions, make sure you comment below because I try to answer all your guys questions. Thanks a lot for your time and please have a great day.